Clark, the standout guard for the Indiana Fever and former Iowa star, faced a surprising and disappointing setback when she wasn't selected for the 2020 for U.S. Olympic team. For those who have followed her incredible journey, this news felt like a punch in the gut. Imagine working your whole life towards a dream only to see it slip away just when you thought you were about to grasp it, Clark said. I know it's the most competitive team in the world, and I know it could have gone either their way. The selection committee's decision to exclude Clark from the roster for the Paris Olympics raised a lot of eyebrows. Clark has been nothing short of phenomenal on the court, with her scoring ability, court vision, and leadership making her a household name in the basketball world. However, the committee decided to go with a more experienced lineup featuring veterans like Brianna Stewart, Sylvia Fowles, Nafisa Collier, Jewel Lloyd, and Chelsea Gray. While the committee's explanation about team dynamics and the need for a balanced roster makes some sense, it doesn't make the exclusion any less painful for Clark and her fans. Honestly, no disappointment like I think it just gives you something, something to work for, you know that's a dream you know hopefully one day I can be there, Clark said. But Clark didn't let the snub keep her down. In a candid text to her coach, Christy Sides, she expressed her frustration and determination, writing, Hey coach, they woke a monster. This fiery response quickly became a talking point, showcasing Clark's resilience and drive to prove the doubters wrong. Coach Sides shared this message with the media, praising Clark's spirit and implying that this setback might just fuel an even greater performance from her in the future. The reaction from fans and media was swift and vocal. Dave Portno, the outspoken founder of Barstool Sports, didn't hold back his criticism. He called the decision, the dumbest thing I've ever heard, and questioned the judgment of those in charge. How dumb are these people? He ranted. Never complain about women's salaries ever again. Make that team fly commercial. Unreal dumb. Clark's fans echoed similar sentiments, flooding social media with support for the young star and questioning the logic behind her exclusion. The outcry highlighted how deeply admired Clark is and how many people believe she deserved a spot on that team. It's not going to fall off a cliff if she's not on the team. And every single decision can't be about playing the optics around one player, the commentator said. Despite the disappointment, Clark handled the situation with grace. In her public comments, she expressed her excitement for the players who made the team and acknowledged the competitive nature of the selection process. I know it's the most competitive team in the world, and I know it could have gone either way," she said. I'm excited for them going to be rooting them on to win gold. 